Just three goals and three points, the, the ideal way to start off the league season. Yeah, fantastic start. Uh, we weren't our flowing best, but uh, we got three goals and three points, so that's all that matters. The two early goals, it looked maybe like sort of stopped our rhythm a little bit in terms of, you know, it, it's such a good start, it took us by surprise a little bit. I think actually the way they played took us a bit by surprise. Last year they commonly played more like a 4 5 1, a 4 2 3 1, and sat in. They actually pressed up, so we caught them twice on the hop, and it kind of. Um, I don't know if we sort of went in their shell and relaxed, but we didn't keep the same tempo and, uh, you know, they, they had a few wee chances, but I think overall, um, the first half was, was pretty good. Yeah, they certainly came and had a go, but we, we looked reasonably comfortable through it the 90 minutes. Yeah, t to be honest, many of our, uh, or sorry, their chances were our mistakes, just uh, trying to clean up on them, and to be honest, I think, uh, I think we deserved it. Uh, three games now inside a week and, and three victories, it's the, the ideal start, I suppose, to, to everything? Fantastic, couldn't ask for any more and the good thing this year is, as you've seen, we're able to make changes with a better squad, better depth in the squad, so hopefully that'll keep us well for the season as well. And gives us confidence going into these next few games, obviously Carrick coming up next Saturday and, and then Bellamina back here after that in the, the Shield semi-final. Yeah, a couple of big derbies, semi-final coming up, uh, hopefully a lot more big games to come at Everpark. Do you think as the, the weeks and the games go on, you get into your rhythm of that, that little bit more and, and start to kind of get more match fit and uh, you know ready for things? Yeah, you, you know yourself, uh, pre-season's pre-season, you can get a certain fitness, but it's, you never really are match fit. So maybe after five or six games you get there and uh, hopefully we'll see the best of us. And with that really good start, confidence grows, do you, do you feel that that's, that's the case in the squad? Uh, we've always been very confident in what we're trying to do. Uh, we don't always get it right, but we, we always stick to what we try and what we believe in. And uh, we try to play the long way and try to try to set an example of how we want to play. And you've got to stick to it, even when times are bad. Yeah, and a full week to, to work on things before Carrick away next season. We, we never really get things easy there. No, Carrick will be a hard game, regardless of what, what, what way you set up or what you do. Carrick's a battle. And they always, uh, they always give us a game, Carrick. And as you say, the manager has options now in terms of whether it's personnel or shape or whatever, so he can sort of take each game as it comes and, and, and work on it like that. Yeah, as I can say, we've got depth in the squad now, but that's up to the manager to pick and choose what he sees fit for which games. Uh, just finally, uh, yourself played in a couple of different positions so far as well, so that, that bit of adaptability between the, the back and the midfield. Yeah, well, <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know what to say about it. It's uh, it just like you say, the manager picks and chooses where and when. And how we play, so I just uh, I'm just happy to be playing at my age. Super, thank you.